basically the judge found that the both sets of statements made in separate places, separate occasions, one in Bukit Aman, one in Burra, uh, both statements were highly defamatory of the plaintiff and very serious defamation as well because they're basically accusing her of being a committing treason, being a terrorist, being a serious criminal basically. And then she went on, uh, as is correct under libel law, to to examine the defences of qualified privilege and fair comment raised by the def def both defendants. Mm -hmm. She found that uh, the IGP uh, was was in a position, what she call it, in a made his statements on an occasion of privilege, meaning mm -hmm. he is the pu public That's official in mm -hmm. charge of the police force investigating, mm -hmm. so he had the right to comment. But she found that Ismail Sabri had strayed beyond his legitimate scope of uh, comment no? so that but having uh, despite finding that she found evidence of express malice on the part of both from the fact that they never bothered to check whether uh, and, and find out and verify uh, you know one uh, is us uh, explanation about what happened uh, damages of uh, 400,000 against the uh, one uh, uh, second defendant, she awarded 600,000, which is exactly the amount given to Haris Saleh by the federal court case in the case we submitted this morning. Yeah, She probably reduced the uh, first defendant's statement probably because it was an occasion of privilege. privilege yeah. right. how, I, have to, um, I just have to state how thankful I am, alhamdulillah, uh, especially to my counsel and of course the judgment made by the Faiza and the Jamaluddin. I think Yama Arif has clearly vindicated um, my innocence. I have stated time and again, I am a patriot. We love this country and um, it's, it's such an important uh, decision for me because it's not just a resounding moral victory, it's a reminder to many other politicians and legislators, you have a duty to this country. If you disagree based on certain positions and policies, it's fine, but to slander and utilize such, um, you know, downright uh, sordid uh, allegations against one another is unbecoming.